Hello, we want to introduce you to one of our favorite commercial installations in year number one of Compass Control. And it was groundbreaking for the installer and now is spreading like wildfire because of actually what's behind the scenes to make this very simple template work. Okay, this was installed at a casino where a integrator had direct TV boxes and they it began by telling them, or by telling the integrator that we need two displays to have DirecTV con uh, uh, content. And DirecTV, along with many other devices nowadays, is an IP device. So this is actually a demonstration of an all IP system where you could have your cable box, your satellite box, uh, any IP controllable device and of course even your displays as well uh, here at Infocom many people are really happy to utilize Sharps uh, IP control Samsung IP control with compass control and a beautiful thing happens here which is when you have an all IP based system As we press a button here, control an IP device, that can goes directly through the Wi-Fi router and then through the wiring to your IP device to be controlled. It's very, very interesting. Really lessens the uh, budget needs requirements for the control system. And of course, with the growth of TCP IP control and the ease of transition in key digital compass control, you're able to just, within a few button presses, convert your RS-232 libraries to, C to TCP IP, because from what we've seen, it's always the exact same codes. It's gonna be a really nice benefit for you, a strictly IP system with compass control requiring no hardware whatsoever, which really has brought a big smile to the face of many of the people here at, uh, that are IT professionals, IT background. They all want to see this go to a hardware-free world, and, uh, and Key Digital Compass Control is enabling that. Let's take a quick walkthrough just uh, for another moment of what this tour is, or this uh, template rather. Very simple. We have Satellite 1. Uh, uh, selected and it's in that held active state if you will we select satellite 2 and now we can see it's a different uh, satellite box that we are controlling here where this one is they called it the wall set this one they called it the matrix set and actually what happens in this template is a visibility toggle you press one button and actually one remote becomes visible or visibility property equals one and the other remote that was visible before that remote becomes visible uh, visibility property equals zero. Very, very easy. Now we also have uh, a group of favorite channels that they've provided us and in here we have an if-then statement uh, uh, that is tied to what satellite we're receiving uh, we are selecting rather and so for example we also have a variable value here we just make a variable out of the air that says selected source equals one or selected source equals two and when we hit the uh, ESPN favorite channel button if selected source equals two then that channel say 100 channel 100 goes to sat box two rather if sat one is selected, then that channel one hundred will go to satellite one. Use um, a if then statement. So there's a large combination of things going on here, and guys have been very, very happy with that. The key digital compass control is not just variables of if then or if else. We have that, of course, but the ability to just create variables to uh, tell your uh, software. If only there was some way I knew uh, the software knew that I'm controlling cable box one right now or satellite box one right now, uh, and you could do that through the variables and array variables uh, as well, variables within variables. It's very, very uh, easy to use, but can be as, as advanced as you'd want it to be. And that's one thing we're really finding out here uh, from all of the integrators and the folks who have been involved in the Compass Control software suite uh, in the past year. So we want to uh, really reach out to you. Get Get working with us at Key Digital. Go to keydigital.com to find out more. Gain your C1, C2, C3 certifications, and you, my friends, will be able to uh, manipulate a template like this or even build it from scratch if you wish. Thanks very much.